on guys wade with wade's adventures here and yet another video um so guys this is a, a storage unit video that we bought it's a we bought an unclaimed 1980s vintage adult storage unit because a lot of the stuff in there was from the 70s and 80s and so guys you know when i do the storage unit videos i try to do the actual video of the storage units and then an unboxing where we go through all the boxes together in my house and then also, guys, I want to do this video, which is basically a recap video of how much I paid for the unit, all my profits, and right now on this video, I'm going to show you the things that I've sold so far. It's a little tough because um, uh, only like 10% of the unit is listed on eBay. Um, so that being said, let me show you the cost of the unit. So this was a really unique unit, guys. Um, this is what's called a um, second chance unit. So the buyer bought this unit, um, or sorry, the, 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 the final bidder bought this unit, but they didn't pay. So storage treasures called me and said, hey, I'll sell this to you at 400 bucks. And um, so it was $460 after fees. And I went ahead and said, yes, I picked it up. Uh, and then this is the actual footage, guys. Give you a little clip. Port it to the kids for when they get older. Wow. Wow. Watch your watches. Want nice. to pull those out too. Let's see if they're worth anything. It's a ring watch. <laughs> a ring watch. <laughs> Can you imagine? You're like, oh, okay. It's... Wow. This thing is full of watches, guys. All right. So that was a small clip so if you haven't seen the storage unit video go check it out it's an hour long but we go through every box all right so that being said um it's really important to me to show you guys that we are actually selling what's out of these units and if we get a unit where we don't make money i will definitely let you know um so the, the let's go through kind of what has sold over this unit so far in no particular order um, so the first thing we sold is this Washington Quarter album. It was for $48.95 with $8.95 shipping on this thing. Um, it was in really, really good condition. Sold this pretty quick, guys. Another one, we, another thing that we sold on this unit, which I actually shipped this out yesterday, which is um, $94.95 with $29 shipping. These were made out of Germany, and they actually um, hold rings. Um, so this was a really cool sold. Remember, it paid four sixty after fees for the unit, so we got to kind of recoup that. Um, this was another thing that we sold. Um, it was a lot. I lotted these things up. Sold them for one hundred and nineteen dollars. Um, they hold basically Lincoln pennies, and um, so sold this bad boy. Somebody bought it, so that was a really good sold. This was really good, guys. So long story short, um, two hundred and twenty dollars of this unit. Um, I sold to a um, jeweler that I've known for a while. They also repair watches and clocks. And so there was um, there was two pieces in there that were fake Rolex um, watches. They they were completely fake. They were like discolored. No way there were they real Rolexes. But he still bought them because some people have those and they need them repaired. And then I also sold him a stack of those um, older watch repair um, magazine books. And so he gave me $220 cash. So I did put it on Instagram. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I put on Instagram. Uh, but then I also sold the remaining watches here for uh, $511 with shipping, guys. There's nothing in that Gucci um, case or anything. But sold this for $511.99. So that was really, really cool. That paid for the unit. I also have these cuffs here, guys. They were no brands in particular. Um, sold these for $25.46. They actually had a price tag of $42.50 on there. Um, so that was that was a really, really cool sold. Um, there was a bunch of um, cigar cases in here. So sold this bad boy for $38.21 with nine, uh, or, sorry, $9.95 shipping. And uh, so that was a cool sold. So we're, we've already paid for the unit. This is all profit at this point. Um, these Sony's fly off the shelves. I've sold a few of them. 48.43. Another lot of um, Lincoln, or sorry, not Lincoln coins. Um, uh, another a lot of uh, coin albums here. 
And these, I believe, what? There was nine of them. So sold those bad boys for $33.96 with shipping. Now I sold a Playboy Donald Trump. Um, now I watched, or I seen a bunch of them for sold, but none of them put a picture of the actual, like him in the interview. Um, so I sold that bad boy and um, got him in there for $50.98. All right. Now here's another four lead crystal set that I sold. This one was $31.96. With fourteen ninety five shipping, guys, and I use my bar to take the pictures, so that's kind of cool. Sold another pair of glasses that was out of this unit. Um, that was a really good find. A little scuffed up on that case, um, but the glasses sold, and that was for um, uh, the buyer did message me. It's like, hey, is there anything wrong with these glasses? And I said they're just a little bit dusty and dirty. They may need cleans and a few scratches, but. I got a good good uh, feedback after that, so that was really cool, and sold that um, um, pretty quick. Now here's a cool music box, guys. Um, it was um, the it was out of the unit, and the music part did not work, and so um, on the bottom here it did not work, but somebody still paid and bought it for forty two forty six with free shipping. It was kind of a smaller music box. All right, here's a Hamilton watch, guys. And um, this bad boy here had a lot of issues, a lot of issues. Um, it had basically, if you look at the head there, the, I don't know if it got water inside there or what happened, but uh, still sold this thing and sold it really quick. Um, and sold another, um, another um, dime uh, vintage case here for your mercury dimes and um, this is really cool $28 and one cent with $8.95 shipping these are actually sold through eBay guys so all right so a couple things here um, I couldn't find this I they basically took the listing off which is weird after I sold it but I sold hustler uh, 1970s 1980s for $64.90 guys and uh, this was a lot, so that was really, really cool. Um, that sold on December 21st. And then um, I also went ahead and sold, if you guys remember also in that unit, there was the um, a cigar uh, boxes. I sold those for $133.02, guys, and that came out of that unit as well. Um, so I sold up three of those, and the guy bought all three. He, there was a 20% off if you buy over two unit or over two items I have in the eBay store, so he got a really good deal. But um, so basically, guys, um, to give you an idea, I've sold $1,654.58 so far from this unit. That's like profit that I've sold, um, and then 220 of that, of course, was local. Um, now, after you subtract the $460, I made $1,194.58 on the unit so far, which is really good profit. Remember, only 10% of it's listed right now. Um, that being said, though, I do own my own box truck. Um, I can't dump for free since my brother owns a construction company here. We use his big old bins. Um, so the only thing really is my time. Time to list, cleaning, obviously, just the stuff that you need to do, and gas and all that. But other than that, over $1,000 so far is crazy cool since I bought that thing a few weeks ago. So, guys, hopefully you like this video. I kind of want to run through here and just show you what I'm selling. So that way you guys can see that this stuff is actually being sold. And uh, whether I make money or lose money, I want to show you all of it. Um, more storage unit videos to come. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. And uh, hit the uh, thumbs up button if you like the video. Um, we got a lot more storage unit videos to come. And I wanted to get a little guy in this one. Huh? And this is Axel, guys. A little six months. So, all right. Have an amazing day. Until the next time, my name is Wade with Wade's Ventures. And you just watched a What Sold video on our latest storage unit. More to come, guys. See ya.